it's good to see him back. But Ronaldo's the top goal scorer. And with today's news that Mitrovic is out for six weeks, then I think he might have the golden boot once again. Yeah, may well have more or less wrapped it up already. And uh, Al Nasser, mixed bag of results in the last few weeks, but they have bounced back to win their last... Nasser can defend well in one-on-one -on -one situations. And there he is, like, running at Cristiano there. So, listen, if you can defend him, you can defend anyone. Yeah, one quick word. They're, they're always successful. But it's not quite what they wanted. Yeah, they didn't think El Halal was going to do how good they've done, to be fair, because they probably thought with the players that we brought in. Sure, and that, the captain that's will, that's for sure. He will, yeah. He'll want to win something. He don't want to be going over there and not only just winning the golden boot. He'll want a trophy at the end of the season that he's lifting. So he'll be up for tonight's game and next week's game. At the end of the game, Carl Topoy can be with a late equaliser for a 2-2 draw. Four. Evening kickoff. It's just over four years since Sabah last tasted victory against Al Nasser. But that late Carl Tokowicz can be month. About maybe in the bottom three, dumped out of the Champions League. It's a great little ball, and he looks like he's in two minds. Does he have the shot? But it's a really good save. Ronaldo trying to blast it, taken by Sadio Mane. Trying to whip that one in. Falls at the feet of Ronaldo. That could spell trouble. Defending. I thought he's going to hit it for the first time, but he tries to. Oh, you've seen him many times over the years. Just hit this first time, but he trots back to his right. But really good defending. He did fall kindly, didn't it? Off inviting for Al Nasser. Well, it's. Well, three players, I think there were three players on the deck in yeah, the Yeah, there is, so you don't know which it covers really well, um, to be fair. Looking back at it, it depends. If the referee gives it, then it's not no. going to... Be sharp. Interesting. And Ronaldo challenging for it. It's a great ball into the box. I think he's just too high for Cristiano Ronaldo. Yeah, fired out. Sadio Mane has it. At the Roman Garibs in the middle. It's Cristiano Ronaldo. The decoy, surely it's got to be Cristiano. We're about to find out. We know what the answer is. It's Ronaldo blasted home. Told you. And fires Al Nasser into the lead. And it's taken only 11 minutes. It had to be power. And that's exactly what it was. Unstoppable. Yeah, it was. I don't know. I, I was watching the replay. I think the goalkeeper might be a bit disappointed that he's not. It's gone in the middle of the goal. There was a lot of power on it. But I think beating from there where you know it's coming through bodies. Nah, I think he can do better, the goalkeeper. I think he's poor goalkeeping. But credit Cristiano Ronaldo. He's here. But there he can see it. I don't know why goalkeepers nowadays can't use their feet. He should be using his feet there to clear it if he can't fully see that but because he doesn't hit that cleanly enough Ronaldo he kind of scuffs it so fortunate but if you don't shoot you don't score goal number 27 in the league for Cristiano Ronaldo his 34th in all competitions this wow. season <laughs> wherever this guy plays his football he scores goals 34 goals this season incredible in London the uh, the London Stadium then they had a mouth-watering game against Brazil at the Bernabeu was Ronaldo all away you won't see it for another few minutes probably. that's the problem and then your defenders will be tired because they're not getting up the pitch at all at all or getting any respite so Tisa on backpedaling against Al Naji into Ronaldo wasn't quite teed up well enough to get a shot away oh, yeah maybe he should have played him played him back in Ronaldo might have a go here He's always looking at this is how he, this is why he scored so many goals. He, when he sees the whip for them, them to do a shifter and get his shot away. And he's sometimes people say a little look around him trying to pick out Ronaldo, who was attempting to return the favor, and it will be a free kick. It's a contact. Mm, he is holding the shirt, but it was the layoff where he'd let it go before if he had blown it. But I think it's a harsh one. This one than he did the last free kick yeah, 10 minutes ago. And he's a good goalkeeper as yeah, well. Absolutely. He is a good goalkeeper. A, but listen, everyone makes a mistake. That was a mistake. And now they giving himself a good talking to before this free yeah, kick. He is. Ronaldo fires it in oh. for number two. <laughs> two free kicks in the opening 20 minutes of the game. It's outrageous, that one. I, I can see the. He's not happy with the wall, and I'm not sure if the wall maybe doesn't jump, but the, 
There's no blame on the goalkeeper that time. It's a fantastic free kick from Cristiano Ronaldo. He saw he had that tunnel vision where he knows where it was going. And it's a fantastic free kick. We have to see the replay. Can the wall do better? But I'm going to give full credit to Cristiano Ronaldo. I think the wall, I think it goes through the wall. Yeah, it goes through the wall again. Goes it, between Krakowiak and Tisseron. Look Tisseron, at that. Tisseron, it can't do that. And you have to stay together, be strong and take one in the head. So as much as it's a good free kick, it's poor, it's poor, um, the wall's poor and it's poor defending again. If you're, if you're the one isolated to be in that wall, you've got to be strong enough. It has to be a strong character. So for me, two goals given to Cristiano, but two really well taken free kicks. It was a lovely looking free kick. It, was, it looked good. It looked really well. So I'm not, I'm saying well done, Cristiano, but poor from the wall. Ottavio for Ronaldo. Tisseron gives him a little nudge and Ronaldo. Running goes. He says, leave it to me, I'm going to thread it through. Ronaldo forced a little wider than he would have liked. Oh, it was on a plate for Sadio Mane. Yeah, and, and you know, Ronaldo, I think he, want, he does want to get his shot or we're going to score. But you can't give Mane a chance like that, can no, you? He's not, not going to miss. Look at the space he's in there. And it was just poked to him by the fingertips of Tatarashanu. Yeah. Mane's 14th goal of the season. Yeah, it's once it, the goalkeeper's trying his best, but the ball in from Ronaldo is a good ball. Like, it skip, skips on, and Mane's not missing that. Abdul Rahman Gary jabbing it forward. Ronaldo, this could spell trouble. Oh, oh it's delightful. It's absolutely magnificent. Ronaldo at his best. A hat trick in the first half. Two hat tricks in the space of a few days. His third of this season. 4 0 Al Nasser, and we haven't got to half time. No, it could get out of hand. They will be checking it, but it does look like it takes a deflection and goes into his part. Once he gets into that position, it's a fantastic finish from Ronaldo. Other, maybe other players might have tried to square it to Sadio Mane. He's on side. He's on there, side, look. yeah, he looks on side. But once he's getting, he's going to a hat trick. It's a fantastic finish. He just thinks it over the goalkeeper. Great little chip. Brilliant, brilliant finish from Cristiano Ronaldo. It is the 65th hat trick of his career, his 55th club hat trick. Outrageous. His stats are a joke. And whatever league Ronaldo goes and plays in, he scores goals. And that's the one thing. And Mane probably would have been moaning if, it, if the book basically it hadn't got in because he was there for a tapping. But when it's Cristiano Ronaldo, and he, here's another stat. Go on, you've got the stats today, I love it. This is the 35th hat-trick he scored since he turned 30. That's ridiculous. At 30, you're meant to go a bit downhill, you know, because you're meant to be getting a bit older. The youngsters are coming. He's improving with age. Any youngster watching, you, you learn from him because he keeps himself in great condition, and that's the one thing he does at his age. Two minutes to go to half-time. Could get a little bit worse for a bar here. It's Ronaldo! And then it's put in... Al-Sulaim Al -Sulaim gets the goal but you know what I'm going for Ronaldo's going for goal there it's a great little ball from Sadio Mane and I think Ronaldo's thinking I need to go for goal here but he's saying I'll have an assist and he puts it on the plate a hat trick and two assists for Cristiano Ronaldo it's brilliant from Al Nasser if they really wanted to they could go sevens, eights and nines if they really want and it will get out of hand for a bar 5-0 and we're not quite at half time. Castro. He's, yeah, Castro, because usually he's always, and then he jumps like that. <laughs> well, Al Majid, Al Sulaim, it has been a masterclass from Al Nasser. Abar haven't been able to lay.